people have heard of the Pony Express. It started in the 1860s, but it only lasted for a year and a half because as the Transcontinental Railroad expanded, as the Telegraph expanded, there was no need for the Pony Express, but the Pony Express went from St. Joseph, Missouri, all the way out to California, and they were due in 10 days or less. Well, the youngest rider for the Pony Express was Bronco Charlie. Bronco Charlie rode for the Pony Express when he was only 11 years old. 11! Well, we have several artifacts from Bronco Charlie. This is a letter where Bronco Charlie actually tells of his conversion to Christianity, where he met Jesus. We also have the autobiography, where he tells his story as a Pony Express rider. And actually, he explains that after the Pony Express, he joined with Buffalo Bill, and he was one of the exhibitions for Buffalo Bill's show as they traveled all across America, as they traveled through Europe. Well, after his time with Buffalo Bill, World War I broke out. And being someone who was patriotic and also adventuresome, he wanted to sign up to be part of the war, but he was 67 years old. In America, that's a little too old to serve in the military, but he found out in Canada, they would take you up to 44 years old. So he got on his horse, he rode to Canada and joined their military. He told them, hey, I'm only 44. They said, well, then you come fight with us. He served for two years in the Canadian military. At the end of World War I, he got out. Well, at the age of 81, he decided he wanted to recreate and retravel what the Pony Express had done years earlier. So he got on his horse. It took him seven months. And actually, record says that he killed 27 rattlesnakes on the way. So still full of adventure. Well, then World War II breaks out. He's 91 years old. And he says, you know what? I want to get involved. I want to serve. Still being very patriotic and adventuresome, he tries to sign up. Well, the military said at 91, you're probably a little too old. But he worked out a deal where he was going to get on his horse and he rode from town to town selling war bonds because he still wanted to contribute to the American spirit and to patriotism in our military. Well, then at 101, the Korean War was going on. And he said his one regret was that he could not join and fight in the Korean War. This guy was full of adventure and patriotism his entire life. And it all started at the age of 11 when he rode for the Pony Express.